everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ms. Rooks 9. This is Daily Rambles. Today we are doing another Arrow episode from Season 2, and the episode is called Scene Red. So, um, up until this point, Roy has been literally been knocked out, and they don't know what's wrong with him really, so they're just keeping an eye on him. Then all of a sudden he wakes up at the beginning of this episode. So he's awake and he's crazy. Like, literally crazy. He starts destroying stuff and he just leaves. He's not really in control of himself. So then um, Sarah and Oliver have a little moment. Then Oliver literally asks um, Sarah to move in with him. And then we cut to Thea being pissy. And then we go to seven years ago in the flashback where Oliver got a girl pregnant. That was not Laurel, who he was dating at the time. <clears throat> then we go to the present day where um, Roy almost hurt Sin, but um, just kind of injures her a little bit, but doesn't really fall on like hurt her, hurt her. And then uh, Mora tells um, Blood that she's dropping out of the race to focus on Thea and her family, that type of stuff. So he's just giving her a heads up, giving him a heads up. And then we have a flashback scene, and <clears throat> so, um, so Mora and Oliver discuss the pregnancy, and then um, Mora says she will handle it. And then we have to go to the present day where um, Sim found Roy, but um, Roy escapes, and um, then Oliver shows up and pretty much breaks his leg and kills the cop. So, I was like, oh, shoot. And then, um, and then, um, Eric gets missed from a doctor, because, like, you've been helping us out, so we're helping you out, so they get the mess for that. And then, um, Sin and Thea talk and how, like, how Roy's not right in the head. And then, we cut to Roy, who hallucinates and sees Thea. And then, um, then we cut to Mora and Oliver talk, and Mora actually knows about um, Oliver being the arrow. But she's she's like, I know. And he's like, How long have you known? And said, she said, Since the undertaking, you are a horrible liar. <laughs> so, and uh, she's actually um, really proud of him. So that was a little touching moment right there. And. Um, when he gets the meds, I forgot to say this earlier, but when he gets the meds from the doctor, he goes back to the uh, air cave getting ready for the um, for the rally. It was like the last hurrah before you're elected mayor and stuff. And um, Felicity's like, how much of uh, this are you supposed to have? He's like, all of it. And he literally gets a needle, gets all of the meds, and just stabs it in his leg, and he just kind of hobbles out a little bit. So anyway... Um, then we go to a flashback scene where Mora bribes the girl with one million dollars and basically says, look, <clears throat> hang on. Okay, they already discussed that later on, so I'm not going to go into that just yet, but I'm getting a little hit on myself. So then we go back to the present day and Thea shows up, and then um, Mora decides to keep running. And then um, Thea was giving a, a like um, subliminal message to Roy to come and see her. And see, but we don't. Uh, what she doesn't know is, but Roy is hallucinating her, and she, and um, her hallucination saying, "Like you, mu I must pay for what I did. You must hurt me, and all this type of stuff." And then. So then uh, Roy gets sedated by um, by snake venom, I think it is. And so he's like heavily sedated on that. And then uh, Sarah decides to break up with Oliver. And Sarah just leaves because they said it's not going to work out. And then uh, Mora starts to tell, oh, then um, when they're leaving, um... Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So, um, going back to the flashback scene, um, Mora tells the girl, um, 
I'm going to give you a million dollars, and here is another million for when you have a baby on one condition. You cannot tell Oliver that the baby is his. Now that you lost the baby and you had a miscarriage and you never to call Oliver ever again. So um, when they so going back to the present day when they leave the rally, they um, all um, Morris starts to tell them another secret. But um, at that precise moment, she says about Malcolm. She literally, they literally get ran by some type of vehicle. And um, next thing you know, Slade tell um, they wake up to Slade Wilson beyond the cray cray, and Slade tells Oliver to choose between Mora and Thea, and Oliver doesn't do that, and Mora actually volunteers, and then he just stabs her and kills her, and then it's like an insane emotional scene. It's so good, and then um, then we have a flashback where um, where is the final morals. Um, Mora scene where after um, she said that um, the girl said that she lost the baby and it's going to Central City and not to con contact her ever again. And so they have their final scene. That's how the, sh the episode ends. So really stellar episode. And I don't say that lightly. So I'm, I usually say the show was good. It was pretty awesome. But this is stellar. Really good episode. So I really did like that. And um, that's, I mean, the, all the scenes were so good, especially the emotional scene at the very end was so touching. I mean, it was really, really good. Ooh, sorry, there's like a bunch of purple clouds coming in. Um, so, like I said, super awesome scenes in this episode, so I really do appreciate that. So, um, I'm going to give this uh, obvious A-plus episode. It was so good. And that's when I do it for me. And if you like this video, please give it a like. Comment down below what you think about your favorite part of the episode. And did I miss anything that was your favorite part that I missed? Because I can't write down every freaking little detail. But no. <laughs> anyway, so um, and comment what you want me what you want me to write to next. And subscribe. And I'll see y'all next episode. Bye everybody.